So we're here today to give you a top tip Tuesday on anaphylaxis and posturing our patient and using the EpiPen. So first of all, if someone has identified as being anaphylactic, they'll have a life-threatening allergy. They will probably have an EpiPen on them. So if they do, get their EpiPen and they'll usually be able to self-administer. Ideally seat the patient, but if I've got the patient seated, if you can come a little bit closer here, we've got the legs bent. Now generally with anaphylaxis, it's a bit of a blood pressure issue. So what we like to do is we like to get the legs out flat. So I'm just gonna get Eb's legs up on the chair. So they're out nice and flat. I take the EpiPen out of its protective case. I'm blue for sky and orange for thigh. I take off the activation cap and I hold it into the leg for three, two, one, and then take it out. If our patient's conscious, this is a great position for them, or we can lay them flat. And obviously, if they become unconscious, put them into recovery position. When giving an EpiPen to someone, we can give another EpiPen within five minutes if it doesn't correct the anaphylaxis or it doesn't have a big impact. And we always need to call an ambulance if we've given someone an EpiPen as well.